lie. Zzz. And truth. Lies and truth. Art can communicate both lies and truth because it's a means of communication sometimes. Uh, art can be seen as a means of communication. You can communicate an emotional truth with art uh, in a way that it's almost more effective to communicate it with art than with words, with like, you know, your normal method of communication. If I deconstruct or like just like robotically explain how something feels, I could maybe communicate the emotion, but the best way to communicate the emotion would be to make art about the emotion, like this is an emotional truth communication, and make you feel the emotion. Like that's the most effective way of getting you to understand, right? It's not by describing the emotion, it's by creating a artistic framework for you to experience the emotion. Poetry, kind of the same way. It's like poetry, the individual words have their meaning, but then together they mean something more than what the individual words mean. So it's like not just simple communication, it's deeper communication in, in, in a way. You can see it like that. I mean, that's, that's one purpose for art. Another purpose is like communicating something that's just on the edge of human experience or just it's very new, something very new and we haven't really grokked it yet, we haven't really understood it yet. Uh, I'm thinking about like stuff that happens on the internet because that's all pretty new. Um, irony poisoning, right? Like what's, what is irony poisoning? You can make art about irony poisoning, and then in making art about irony poisoning, you're reaching out, you get this nebulous term, irony poisoning, the art sort of defines it more and more and more, and then eventually, you know, that kind of stuff becomes a part of the human subconscious or whatever, and we can deconstruct it from there, and we can, like, figure everything out about it, and at that point, it's kind of like old hat, you know, but uh, when it's new and it's interesting, that's the time when you want to jump on it and, like, and, and, like think about it and analyze it and take it apart and... Um, art can be a way of communicating uh, this new and weird world to uh, different people, different kinds of people that might not understand it. Um, so, yeah, I mean, there's more to it than that, <laughs> probably. Uh, but those are the things that come to mind when I think about art as communication. And let me know what you think in the comments below.